Hello, me again from Lima, Peru, and this time I'm getting a shoe shine. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what it's going to cost yet, but from my understanding, it's going to be a little bit cheaper than if I were in one of the hotels. That I don't know yet because I haven't been charged. But I did want, uh, I'm, standing, uh, I'm actually in front of the Sun St. Martin Plaza, which is a popular place here in Lima. And what's interesting is the cultural differences you'll see here that you might see in other parts of the United States. The only issue is maybe getting these kinds of shoe shines or seeing people walking around, uh, seeing a lot of people selling, selling, or actually the horns honking this much, you feel almost feel like you're in New York City. Now, Lima is the capital of Peru, so it is a very busy place. You see taxi cabs all over the place. You see people walking around all over the place. And the, and the issue here is that there is no uh, subway system, so folks either have to walk, they have to take a taxi, take a bus. So, and it's a very different culture. Of course, 80% uh, of the folks here speak Spanish, and then 20%, uh, 20% other 17 to 20% speak a native language. Also, you have a uh, different currency here, of course, the sole, and uh, it roughly translates right now in 2010 to about three soles to one dollar. It's a very thriving community, and the food is terrific. So if you get the chance to come to Lima, Peru, put it on your, one of your destinations. From Lima, this is Dr. Torres.